everyone. So today we are going to talk about when and how often do I clean uh, my hamster's cage. There are three main things that I do within this process. Uh, the first one is spot cleaning. The second one is rearranging items in her cage. And then the third one is a full cage clean. First, we are gonna talk about um, spot cleaning. Now, spot cleaning I do every single day. During this process, I kind of make sure that uh, if things are knocked over or anything, I'm gonna put it all right back up and make it look pretty again because hamsters, when you're sleeping, they can go crazy and have so much fun in their cage at night and just get everything messy, knocking things over. And um, so during the spot cleaning daily, I like to put things back in place and kind of fluff up the bedding as well because it really gets flattened out. And I like it when it's fluffy and kind of fresh looking for when she comes back out when she wakes up. I also make sure that the water bottle is still working and that she has water and also her food. I just check to see what she ate from the night before and I will kind of go by that to see if I need to refill it. Um, I will have a daily diet video at some point show you guys uh, how often or when I feed her. Are just some of the things that I usually look for when I'm just spot cleaning her cage daily. Second thing that I do is rearranging her cage during the month. So around every week or so. So what I will do during this process is I will take a bunch of the things that are in our cage already and I'll move them around, rearrange things to kind of uh, make it a little bit more different for her so she's not like having the same exact setting for the whole month through. For example, I'll take her wheel and move it to a different side of the cage and or sometimes I'll put some new items in there just to uh, make it a little bit different for her. And also any hamster really, really enjoys when um, things, when they can explore new things. So I always like to do that at least once a week during the month. And the last process is a full cage clean. And I usually do this once a month. It really depends on how big your cage is. I feel like if you do have a Ikea Detop or a humongous DIY cage, um, it can probably go a little bit longer without a full clean cage clean once a month uh, But my cage at the moment is 684 square inches and I do feel like um, I am going to have to clean her particular cage at least once a month. We're not going to clean her cage today but um, what I will usually do is take out all of the bedding and just give it a nice uh, wipe down with a with some vinegar and water. That's when she will get a uh, new bedding, new toys, and a whole new layout and theme for the new month. I hope that this video was somewhat helpful to anyone that needed to know this information, and I will see all of you in my next video. Bye!